Thank you for watching this video. In this video, we try to compare the functionalities of ClickView and Tab and see how you can create dashboards in ClickView, how easy it is to create dashboards in ClickView and how it easy it is to create in Tableau. So different clients with different uh, requirements, different setup may go for ClickView or Tableau based on, based on this. This is two part series video. In the first part, we will evaluate ClickView and in the second part, we try to evaluate uh, Tableau. And let's see, uh, you know, you can choose whatever uh, tool suits to you the most. So let's understand ClickView now. I have ClickView here and this is the personal desktop edition of ClickView. I click on new file here on top and then it prompts me for a wizard. I cancel because I will do it in the fashion a developer would do. So I have a data set. This is a data of people like Fred Smith, Christine Smith. It's a family name Smith and with their with the various information like age, gender, monthly income, what's the poverty line, are above the poverty line or below, what's their education, are they employed or not, and when the data was taken. So we want to create a dashboard to understand uh, how many people are uh, working, how many people are not working, what their income are, are they above the poverty line or below and and uh, we figure out uh, different dashboard functionalities doing this so let's go back and click view and there's a script on top of here this is script click on this this is an this is a tool which can connect to any database like you can connect to our existing database you can connect to sql server you can actually pull data out of oracle and sql and multiple other data sources combine them in in this click view tool and you can create a consolidated report or dashboards on top of it it's it's a very powerful tool you can distribute the report using click publisher you can distribute the reports uh, in email in pdf you can push the report out to the users i'm just talking about click view now in the second video as i told earlier we'll talk about tableau so here i will use table files and you can see this family xls file which i just showed you and this is the sheet header size i can put lines and i can put one here just to understand we can we can say it's it's embedded levels so we don't have to put lines here i say next I will skip this step and you can see the first name, family name, age, gender coming up directly in the export. This is the load statement which it generates. We'll discuss about this in the videos to come and I say finish. As soon as I say finish, you can see here the load statements have been written. So ClickView is a tool which helps to to get a lot of control over the type of data, the kind of data you want to export, the way in which you want to want to export into your into your uh, document. So we will we talk about it in detail. If you have any questions, you know where to contact me. Uh, click on OK here, and you can see that there's a button reload. So it asks me to save the document. I can say here. Uh, I can say click view to evaluation and click on save. You can see that it's executing the script and it's searching the data. It's all fetched. Click on close. 
So click view mostly works on an associative relationship between the data set. So this is a dashboard. I can create right click and create multiple objects like list boxes, chart. So let me create a list box and I can say select uh, select uh, poverty line or or education so I can say education here and click on OK so I can go to the properties and in the elements you can see there are various tabs in the expressions add expressions here or so it's a it's a very good tool of for for uh, doing your analysis i can turn education here this is the field and you can create your expressions you can sort the data you can present it in a text or number format we will discuss in detail in the coming videos so education now i want a chart which can drive this so I click on the chart and I would say um, details and I can click with different chart types of charts or I can create a straight table I say next I can select education is it the employed or not uh, I can select my income and I can select poverty line. Click on next. Here in this, this is your expression editor. You can write expression. So you can say total count of first name, for example. And I say paste. Here, I don't want to include monthly income, so I'll remove it and save. This is the count which I said. Say finish. You can see here that there are. I have clicked master here, so I have masters. How many people are employed and how people are above and below poverty line? This is a very simple list report. Now. I will create another data set for charting. So let me create a chart now and let me create a bar chart. So I can say chart here. So you can add multiple objects, but this is an option to change the chart types. You can select the chart types you want to change, and I'll show you how it works. So I would select uh, education here and I want to select poverty line, click next. You can again say count of first name. For, for this sample data I know that first name is distinct but you can put it based on or count it based on social security number. Or some unique identifier number for that customer, but I have not done that in this demo. I can create an expression here and I say sum of monthly income. I want to know what is the total of monthly income from different education background, people belonging to different educational background. So I say finish here. You see the chart and you can arrange in the fashion. Or place you want to see this. Now I can change the view by clicking this button. This is highly interactive dashboarding using using click view. And let's say I click on masters, so you will see that the entire set changes. It's a, it's a great it's a great tool. You can share it. You can export it into different formats and you can save it. 
you can create multiple sheets and it's it's pretty pretty good tool for for doing analysis uh, you can implement clip view enterprise wide uh, in my in my uh, couple of client places we have implemented uh, for 200 to 200 users on on uh, on clip view who have the desktop edition and then using the server click click view server and publish it to publish it to various three to four thousand employees using these reports but uh, we can we will discuss how to implement a project in click view in some time uh, i hope you like this video please catch up for the second video which is evaluating tableau and i will show you how to use a tableau tool thank you